Hey everyone, let's create our first bounty on Algora. We just registered and up top we'll click create bounties. And first thing we need to link our GitHub account. Let's go ahead and do that. Authorize Algora PBC, Public Benefit Corporation. And now the second and final step is to install the Algora app in our organization and repository of our choice. We will select the open source startup organization. We can select the specific repository. We'll do the web app and let's install the app. That's it. The app is installed. Algora tells us to use the bounty command in an issue EPR. And we also have an org page that gives us the same instruction. And now if we head over to an issue on GitHub, we see a new feature with the description and the code base reference, the mockup, the spec. We're going to type slash bounty 500. And the bounty has been created. And if we head back to our org page, we will see the bounty is right here. It should also be in the public bounty discovery on the platform for all the developers to see. Here it is. And even appear on the activity feed of the platform. It's right here. That's it. I hope it was useful and hope to see you on Algora soon. But before we go, how could we improve this onboarding? Notice that Algora never asked me what I hope to accomplish. Maybe I want to create a private bounty and share it with a friend or share it with an expert contributor capable of more challenging work. This is supported. Or maybe my company is hiring engineers and I would like to streamline the process, find new people and do paid trials with my top candidates. All these things Algora should discuss before loading the app so that if someone doesn't complete the steps, at least we can capture their intention. This way, we can measure conversion and improve it for both categories of users. We can engage people after they sign up with emails, and we can give them the right resources to help them be successful. At this stage, we can also discuss pricing and show our different plans. We'll improve our apps onboarding, and we'll share what we learn. See you in the next video.